Miss Universe Canada 2020 <laughs> Nova Stevens. This video has been a long time coming. I, right before I started filming this video, somebody sent me the full length to the, length? The full link, the link? I don't know what I'm saying. The link to the full video of Miss Universe Canada 2020, like the full competition. I tried to find it on the YouTube, it wasn't there. I still don't see it there. I don't know if like I am missing something. But anyway, someone sent me the link to the full show. So now I can finally watch the full show. I haven't been able to watch it. So someone sent it to me. I am going to give a more in-depth review on the full show. But today, because this is what I ended up preparing, we are going to talk about the performance of the winner of Miss Universe Canada 2020, Nova Stevens. Let's go. I haven't even watched this full thing yet. Here we are. We're showing some of the opening number in this video. And let me say... Gino, he's the choreographer. He's been the choreographer since I've ever competed at Miss Universe Canada 2013, 2016 when I passed the crown. And some of the moves just like take me right back to those memories. The outfits kind of crack me up. They remind me of like Miss USA 2006 or something. But you know what? I have a lot of love for all these girls. They put themselves out there. It takes a lot of courage to step out on the stage, even though this isn't really a stage due to COVID. They have to wear the clear mask things but it, it it is weird it's weird to see this as a show in like a ballroom right like it's so if you guys haven't seen it i mean you'll see it on the screen so I'm gonna put it sorry about that motherhood okay nova's intro she looked beautiful i mean she's absolutely stunning there's so many people who are already saying that she could win miss universe i'm seeing some of the girls that i coached i coached a few girls from miss universe canada this year and it makes me so proud to see them i feel like a proud mom watching this i can't wait to watch like the full actual show because i've only seen clips that they've either sent me or that some of you have sent me nova just stands out she's very tall which i always say height is not the determining factor by any means but obviously if you're tall you stand out naturally, right? You can't help but stand out. So it's definitely a benefit for her to have the height. Again, it's not like a make or break, but it, it is a benefit. Nova in swim. Okay, work it girl, work it. Beautiful smile, love the way she's, mm -hmm, Lily loves it too. Love the way she's flipping, the or flicking the, Thingy. She has a couple of great turns, but let me say I do think she needs to up the enthusiasm, up the wow factor for Miss Universe. You guys have heard me say before that at Miss Universe, like you have to have it all. Like you have to be smiling, you have to be smizing, you have to be hitting your poses, you have to leave the crowd breathless. Here she comes in her gown. Love this gown on her. Oh, they're showing some shots of her in this purple gown. I, honestly, I love the purple gown on her even more. I feel like the purple gown just brings a lot more like wow factor, I think. The gold is beautiful as well, but the purple gown is definitely giving me more of, of a wow vibe. Let's hear what she has to say. This is a statement. Good evening. I am Nova Stevens. I'm a Canadian and a black woman. As I stand before you, I want you to see me as a black woman. Yes. I want you to see color. Because seeing color does not mean you're a racist. Instead, it allows you to see the struggles experienced by people of color. You've heard the news. You've read the stories. Innocent black lives have been lost to police brutality and hate crimes. We want you to see us. We want you to hear us. We want you to feel us. I ask that you diversify your surroundings because when you do that, it creates a better understanding. Know that hate is taught. Therefore, we can unlearn it. So let's do that. Let's get back to our truest essence, which is love. Love. Okay, I loved that statement that she gave. That was super powerful. I thought that was amazing. Now that we're the girls are being asked from former Miss Universe Canada's different questions, of course, I wasn't asked. I am not surprised. This question comes from Miss Universe Canada 2003. Canada is a beautiful mosaic of different cultures, ethnicities, and beliefs. How can we use these differences to further strengthen our national unity? so amazing that Canada is a mosaic of different cultures. That is our true beauty. 
how we can make it better is using our voices to encourage each other to diversify our surroundings. As I said before, when you diversify your surrounding, it creates a better understanding. And there's nothing better than loving one another. And that comes from being Canadian. Thank you. Miss Universe Canada 2020 is... Oh my gosh, she's so excited. I love the crowning moment because she just look, is like so excited. She's like shaking, absolutely shaking. I love that. You can see that the first runner up, she's disappointed, but how can you not be disappointed if you don't win the crown? An amazing crowning moment. Here comes Alyssa Boston, about to put the sash and crown on her. Amazing. Oh, I love the new crown. It's very inspired by the new Miss Universe crown. Also love that. It matches her dress very well. Beautiful. Okay, you guys, so overall from what I have seen of Nova, because I have seen more than just this video, I really do think she has what it takes to make it into the semifinals at Miss Universe. Of course, I would love to see her rise into the top 10, the top five, the top three, win the title of Miss Universe. How incredible would that be to see another Canadian win Miss Universe? I would be so thrilled, so excited. I am wishing the absolute best for her on her journey. I do believe she has what it takes. She has the enthusiasm, she has the voice, she has the platform. She has a lot of amazing and very much needed things to say. So I am very impressed to see her. I cannot wait to see what she brings along her journey. I do feel like we need to see a little bit more of that like wow factor, Miss Universe factor in her walks, in her presentation, but that can be learned. So I feel like if she just really brings an amazing walk and really amps up her stage presence, we could see her easily rise to the top of Miss Universe. Sorry for the low light guys, it is nighttime here. It is actually only 6 p.m. But because of daylight savings, it's even darker, even sooner. So annoying. Anyways, let me know in the comments what you guys think of Nova Stevens. Do you think she can rise to the top of Miss Universe? Let me know your thoughts and I will see you guys next time. As always, if you want to hear more from me, you can always hit that subscribe button, hit the notifications bell so you're notified when my next videos come out. And I will see you guys next time.